Welcome back to Tennisshare. Recently, in the iOS 18 RC update, Apple enabled a new activation lock for iPhone parts. As Apple mentioned back in April, they would loosen the repair policy for iPhone users and independent repair providers, making used Apple parts no different from new ones. However, they also stated that they would extend the activation lock to iPhone parts to limit iPhone theft. In this video, you can see that someone in China has already encountered this issue, where the iPhone screen shows that the display is locked to the owner. So here's the situation, if your iPhone has replacement parts, and those parts come from an iPhone that is activation locked, or in lost mode, once your device is on iOS 18, or the official iOS 18, it will be locked. Your iPhone will not function unless you know the Apple ID and password of the original device. It's understandable that Apple is trying to protect their customers' iPhones, but many people are unaware that their replacement parts could be from a stolen iPhone. You may ask, why don't they just go to the official store for repairs? The answer is simple, other places are cheaper. If you have unknown parts in your iPhone, it's best not to update to iOS 18 RC or the official iOS 18. If you've already updated, don't worry, you can try downgrading your iPhone back to iOS 17, though this will result in data loss. To downgrade, visit ipswdu.me, choose your device and model, download the iOS 17 firmware and open iTunes or Finder. I'll use Finder as an example. Hold the Option key or Shift key if you're on a win and then click the Restore button. Select the firmware you just downloaded and your iPhone will begin the downgrade process. Once completed, your device will return to iOS 17 and the parts lock should be removed. If you encounter issues using iTunes or Finder, or if you get an error during the downgrade, you can try Reiboot, a professional Apple device repair tool that includes upgrade or downgrade features. Check the link in the description to download it. Choose the iOS downgrade option and Reiboot will automatically match the correct firmware for you, allowing you to downgrade easily back to iOS 17 without the lock. What do you think about Apple's new feature? Leave a comment to let us know.